Would you like to practice and improve your reading skills? Well, I'm gonna help you do just that. What's up everyone? My name is Wes. This is Interactive English, which is all about helping you guys practice and improve your English skills. Today, we are going to focus on reading and we are going to do an active reading activity to, to help improve your reading comprehension. So what we're going to do is I am going to show you a text. You will read it and then afterwards, I'm going to ask you some questions to see how much you understood and, and how much you remember from, from what you read. Today's topic is about the cheetah, a truly amazing animal, and if you don't know much about the cheetah, then you will very soon. And just so you know, this reading is probably around the level of intermediate to advanced. Before we begin, I I'd like to go over some vocabulary words with you. These are some words that you are going to find in the reading. The first one is characterized, and what this means is it's talking about the features or the qualities that something or someone one has, the, the things that really distinguish this person or, or this thing characterized. The next word is slender, and this is an adjective that, that means the same thing as thin, but it's really a way of saying that somebody is thin, but they're also fit. They're thin and they're fit, they are slender. The next word is contrast, and this just means that, that something is different. You're, you're talking about the differences between things. So if something is in contrast to something else, you're referring to the differences between these two things. Finally, we have uniformly. This is an adverb that, that basically means the same, that something is the same throughout. So if something is the same in all cases, we could use it as an adjective and say that something is uniform or as an adverb uniformly. Now that you know those words, you, you can keep an eye out for those as you're reading the text and, and hopefully this will help you understand the material a bit better. So I'm going to show you the reading and the words are just going to scroll across the screen and just try to do your best, try to remember as much as you can and, and really try to put a picture in your mind because that's going to help you remember the information. After we're done reading, I will ask you some questions to, to test your reading comprehension and I'll also give you the answer answers as well. Are you ready to learn about the cheetah? Let's begin. Now that you've read that information about the cheetah, I have some questions for you, and I'll give you a little bit of time to think about the answer, and then I'll tell you what it is. Here's your first question. What are two characteristics of the cheetah? The answer is A a small rounded head and a spotted tail. So in the text, there were several characteristics of a cheetah that were mentioned. A cheetah has a small rounded head, a spotted tail, it has a deep chest, a slender body, and what else does the cheetah have? Oh yeah, a spotted coat and black streaks across its face. Here is your next question. The cheetah is, hmm. The answer is A, taller than a leopard. Remember in the reading it said that cheetahs are taller than leopards but much smaller than lions. You ready for your next question? Here it is. How much does a cheetah weigh? 
The answer is B, 21 to 72 kilograms. This is very specific information from the reading and it, it's like you're really trying to read for those key details because numbers, those are often key details when you're reading. So how did you do? Are you now experts on the cheetah? If you did this activity and you performed well, then let me know, write that in the comments and just say, I am a cheetah expert. That way I know that you did the activity, you answered the questions correctly and you practice your reading skills. Thanks so much for watching. If you enjoyed this activity, please hit that like button. And as always, I will see you next time.